Welcome back to Elden Ring. Let's explore the city of Nokron. Let's take a look at the map. Ah! Yeah, we are in the Siafra River location. Just above it all. So this is how you get to the higher area. First off, summoning. <laughs> oh no, that's not a good sign. Be wary of shield. Try circling around. Interesting that you can't use your horse up here because you can down below. Wait a minute. The architecture of this place, or, or not the architecture, but. Oh, there's an item back there. The. How this place is constructed is bizarre. There's water here. But we're above land, and there's. Water? <laughs> what? That's just bizarre. Oh, hey. Aww. They're cute. So far, these enemies are super easy. <gasps> Ghost Glovewort's Picker Bell Bearing. Should open a new store.
Great Shield Soldier Ashes. Looks like five of them. Some real high level smithing stones. satisfying. Weak foe. Hello. Oh, you got the liquid blade. That thing is so cool. Sleep time. the liquid blade. I bet we're going to be fighting them at some point. see the land down there. Barely, but yeah, you can. We are very, very high up from where we were before. Oh! Butterfly head. Oh, true. Could this be a bird? <laughs> oh, it looks like we have a boss just up here. Something incredible. Behind. Oh. Thank you. Weak foe ahead. 
Let's take our flask of wondrous physic. Who am I fighting? Is it the goo in the center? Is it going to take the form of something powerful? Yes. Wait. That's me. Those are my spells. Literally all of my spells. Mimic tier. Aw. That's so cute. And that's so cool that it's literally casting my spells. Not just like generic sorcerer spells, but specifically mine. They're even good at dodging just like me. Oh, are you out of mana? Oh, apparently not. Ow. No, not that one. That one's too good. Oh, should have went in and did a stab. That's a really cool fight. Silver tier mask. Seems familiar. Time for pickle. <laughs> look at their look at the model of that person. Look at that face. <laughs> that person saw themselves looking just like that and were like, yes, I wanna fuck me. What is wrong with people? I'm upvoting that. What is wrong with me? Mask fashioned from the corpse of a formless silver tear, supported by its hardened shed husk. Greatly increases arcane to the detriment of physical attack power. To imitate the imitator is a cunning play indeed. That thing is pretty heavy. Well, it's better than what I'm wearing, but what I'm wearing is essentially nothing. So it increases my arcane by eight. It doesn't say how much it decreases your attack power by. But to give you 8 arcane, it's probably quite a bit. I just want to see what that looks like. Oh, that's cool. That is so weird. You can see it, especially on the back. You can see it kind of undulating. I wonder what it feels like in there. Imagine it feels like your face, your entire head is just wet. remember if I was building up to anything in particular, but let's go. Oh, I can't level up actually. I need more than 30,000. Jesus Christ. That should be enough. Int? Vigor? Mm. It's 
to Vigor. No precious item. Maybe the other way. No item ahead. It is a gorgeous view, though. horseback battle wait oh why thank you I hear a ball I hear a beetle oh, it's probably there Just birds. A lot of birds here. So many. survive that maybe from the not from here but from the level beneath me Ugh. no item ahead time for left I'm still gonna check real quick can never completely trust Dark Souls players, but they were telling the truth. Lord of Blood, your eminence, I beg you, grant me a seat at the table of the dynasty. Long live the Mogwin dynasty. I could get there, I could definitely survive the fall to there, although it would be very difficult to jump on all of these without dying. Is it really leading to anything though? I don't see anything. So that one there is the one we've already been to. We've been to that. This one we have not been to. I bet there is something up there. I mean, it just looks too obvious for there to be nothing. And it might actually be possible possible to survive the fall from there to there. Maybe. Probably not. Oh wow, I see a lot of blood stains over there. Guess where we're going. Ooh. There's more to this than I thought. No item ahead. I still want to do it, though. Oh, wow. How did you get in there? You can just fit. Time for hiding place. Hole. A good hole is always very comforting.
oh, this is leading to something. Horse, horse. I could also jump onto that. Oh, so many possibilities. Oh, I could have landed on that. And then from there, could I get somewhere? Maybe. Sorry, Dorian. Here you go. Clarifying Horn Charm plus one. Raises focus? Greatly raises focus. Which governs resistance to sleep and madness. What does Celestial do? Close to where we were before. Just down there. a little thing I could fall down onto there. No jumping ahead. Yeah, wasn't going to. I'm so glad they let you use your horse here, or this would take forever. Dead end ahead. Aw. Really? Oh, what a shame. Fortnite. <laughs> oh no! Well, I didn't have that many souls, it's fine. Okay, can I get from here around the corner? No, <laughs> no, that is not gonna work. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, that's interesting. It gave me the you're falling to your death camera, but I actually wasn't quite falling to my death. I kind of stuck onto the side just a little bit. Could I have jumped from there? I don't know if I was like slipping or if I was actually stuck and if I stopped moving, I would have been okay. However, I think you're obviously not meant to go there, which means there's no way there's an item. Perhaps I could get to the lower level by doing this. Oh. No, it gives you the fall camera before you even touch that. So it's just a death plane. I don't think you can avoid that. So let's be normal and go to the normal place. Oh, all the animals are following them. Look at that. Cute. Oh, I don't even want to kill them. Certainly not the animals and not even the creatures. 
I mean, animals are creatures, but you know what I mean. Not the, not the enemies. Ostensibly enemies. I don't even want to kill the enemies. Are you casting on me? Or are you just having fun on your own? Oh. I think they're just grooving. I think I kind of do need to take these out. How the animals are so cute. Eesh. Don't mind me. Okay, I think we're fine. What is that singing? Mother bat, maybe? What the fuck is going on over here? Is it a bat mom or is that the one casting? What a beautiful voice. I don't want to hurt them either. I don't want to hurt any of these. Ooh, nice. I guess you get down there by going there. Maybe? I'm not sure where you'd go to after that. Gesturing. Oh, just waving at all the people. <laughs> oh, because it kind of looks like they're waving back. <laughs> they're all just so excited. Hey, hi. Nice to see you. Didn't notice a thing. Is so gorgeous. Looks so clean. Gorgeous view, yeah. Oh, sorry, puppy.
That one's health. The other one might be mana. Did I need that? I actually didn't. I, I don't need those at all. Not sure how many of these we need to light or exactly what it's getting us entrance to. Haven't found the door yet. Puppies. Ah, this is what we're trying to light the way for. Oh no, I didn't want to do that. I love that faster spell casting time. So we have three and we need, oh, we need three more. Oh no, oh no. Hollow horn grounds, looks like it's another ancestor spirit. I'm sure it's different than the other one in some way though. Body looks the same. <laughs> Look at him just chilling with the animals. Oh, there's one to light back there. No way to avoid this conflict. Sorry. All the animals go run. No, no, don't shoot them, don't shoot them. Sorry. You have a very lovely voice. Shining horned headband. Oh, that could be really pretty. Dog ahead. It is a dog. Dog. Headband decorated by a pair of shining horns, worn by ancestral follower shamans. Horns with buds that also shine are ideal ceremonial items for ancestral worship. Strengthens ancestral infant's head. Don't know what that is. But compared to my current headband, it's pretty much just better. It's very slightly worse at magic protection or elemental protection, but much better at physical. Significantly heavier as well. Is that gonna... No, I'm not gonna put me in heavy load, so that's okay. How does it look? Is it fashion? Oh, I love all the things dangling from it that move when you move. 
I mean, it is pretty. It is kind of a lot, though. Like, it takes... <laughs> it's quite loud, and it takes up a lot of screen space because of how much it sticks up. Hmm. I don't know. It somehow feels wrong to wear it because I'm coming here and just messing up everything that they're doing. Killing them. Accidentally killing some of their animals. Just being an absolute dipshit and then I'm wearing one of their... Like, ceremonial items? That just feels fucked up. I don't think I want to wear it. For that reason alone. Jelly. Modeled necklace plus one. Greatly raises robustness, immunity, and focus. Oh. Just gonna grab those back. And do the same thing, but this time, get the first jump off before I fall. little cave. Add that to the pile. I don't think I could survive that fall. Friend. That fall, I think I could survive. Could this be a jumping, but shortcut? And then they point it over in that direction. Yeah, I could definitely survive that for sure. But let's check the other way first. Hmm. Strong foe ahead, try ranged battle. Yeah, I was just thinking that. Crucible Horn Shield. It's 
takes 26 strength. Oh, the guard boost is so good. 60. Ah, oh, it's considered a great shield. That explains it. Yeah, all the great shields have really good card boosts. Great shield of red-tinged gold, carried by crucible knights, features a great horn. An ancient holiness dwells within. The crucible horn skewers foes when performing shield bashes. Ouch. Sounds really cool, though. Siofra Aqueduct. Ah! Can't use the horse here. Try parrying and then luring out. Don't need to, thankfully. Who are you? They look very powerful. Okay, I might lose it. Come on, don't... Ah, oh, yeah. Figured that would happen. Bye-bye. Oh, that's just for healing. I don't need that. Missionaries Cookbook 5. I think that's under info. No. Key items, I guess. Yeah. Sacred Order Pot. That's this one. Oh, it's basically a more powerful holy water pot. This says throw at enemies to inflict holy damage. This says throw at enemies to inflict heavy holy damage. It takes... Oh, the normal one takes a tarnished golden sunflower. This one takes a normal golden sunflower. Like a healthier one. And also a golden centipede. I haven't found any golden sunflowers. I'm guessing those are on the Altus Plateau, probably. Higher up, closer to the bigger tree. That's another Crucible Knight. Just that one seems to have more of a staff. Oh, whoa! <laughs> At least they don't have a shield. That's going to make it a lot easier to kill them. Damn, that range, though. And the power. That did a good 70% of my health bar in one hit. Where exactly does use of the horse end? Oh, I need to... Oh, wait, do I need to kill the Crucible Knight that was here? Is that a normal enemy or a mini boss? It seems to be gone. Can't use the horse here. Yeah, it is gone. Okay. <laughs> I think I'm going to use my Flask of Wondrous Physic to get more magic damage.
Nope, 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 nope. Ah. Those things scare the crap out of me. They're so intimidating. Be wary of group. Try poison. Hmm. Hey friends. Hey. I have a feeling I know what this is going to say. Healing. I'm sure that's an incantation. Mm hmm. Only takes 11 faith. Bug. A golden rune level 13? That might be the highest level I've ever gotten. Try target lock. Ooh, thank you. Who dat? Oh, just a weak one. A lot of them, though. Is that an NPC? Whoa, wait, what? What's that? Was that like... Hold on. Yeah, that's if you like try to do damage to them. I guess it considered me um, suddenly backing up as 
trying to do damage or something? Or trying to do like some sort of a combat thing? Yeah. Oh. Oh, that's definitely a boss fight. Especially since there's a stake of Marika right outside. Okay, that just leaves the boss. Seek coffin. Strong foe. Valiant gargoyle. Hey! Damn. They don't have that much health, though, and this is really effective against him. Oh. Oh no, there's another. <laughs> Wonder how good stones would be against him. Stones versus stones. Let's try it. Oh, can I use... No, no horse. good damage, but, um, this is just faster. I gotta kill this one before the other one gets to me. <laughs> one more, one more. Yeah, okay. Can you please just let me heal? And, like, keep the health for more than a second. Oh, God, that was cool, though. Whoa, that's also cool. That 
That's so cool. Almost there. Ah. Second try, not bad. Ah, Gargoyle's Greatsword and Gargoyle's Twin Blade. I can't use my horse here? Oh no. It's gonna take a while to explore it. Let's take a look at those weapons. The... Wow, the Greatsword only takes 18 strength. That's not much at all. Bronze Greatsword wielded by Valiant Gargoyles. Just like the wielder, the missing parts have been mended with corpse wax. A patchwork of champions. Ew. And the Twin Blade. There it is. 18 strength. Yeah. Pretty much the same description. I see a sight of grace. Oh, I love how the sand looks illuminated by the sight of grace. One level. Let's do int. Yeah, I don't think I want to rest in that coffin. <laughs> I know it said seat coffin. I'm sure I need to do that at some point. Um, I'm going to put a mark on the map here just so I don't forget that I need to come back here. Yeah, I think that's it for here. Wait, the person we met was... D? Beholder of Death? Wasn't the person back at the round table called D? Is that the same D? Oh, this is D, Hunter of the Dead. Okay. There's at least two Ds, then. Let's upgrade our Moon Veil to plus six. And the Flail to plus 15. Oh, we can go again to plus 16. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode. So I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return, well, there's still the coffin to go inside of, but I also want to return to this area because I suspect all of the things to light are probably located here. <laughs>